pop news? Yes. All right, so yesterday we started with a meow, right? Did you see all that? It was very popular, I think. Did you, sir, you didn't <laughs> notice that at all? All right, so let's let's just do it again today. Meow, it's a perfect start for today's pop news. Yesterday we showed you the behind the scenes video of the movie adaptation of the Broadway hit Cats. And now the official trailer is actually here. And people, I mean, it's for real. For real? Oh, got it, got it, got it. Took me a minute. I know. Thank you. Just, just keep up with the jokes, Cecilia. Sorry, just, just, sorry, sorry. I used all the cowards yesterday. There's not a lot left. All right. It features Taylor Swift, Idris Elba, Jennifer Hudson, Judy Dench, and more. How could there be more? But they look a little different, so check this out. Are you going to try for a different life? A new day has begun. Chills again. Yeah. Okay, Amy's seen it three times and has chills. The trailer's trending as soon as it dropped, hitting almost a million views in its first hour, but not everyone is loving the digital fur technology. I don't get it. I love it. You no, love I don't it? get why it's, it's not, why, why everyone is, is not singing its praises. It's, it's amazing. I'm so excited. TJ? You see the face? Yeah. <laughs> um, so I do. I see the face, which means to me you don't actually get the digital fur technology. I'm not there yet. Okay. Um, it has, we have time. It's not yeah, out You so might old. have to see it a couple times. Oh, I think it's well. definitely a step up from the digital fur technology that I use on Instagram every day. <laughs> Just take it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cute cat. I don't know. No. I, I don't. I just. You're I just. Pretty kitty. All right. Uh, so the movie opens. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to get all this makeup on you. Believe me, I'm wearing a lot of makeup right now. Uh, uh, so uh, it, 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 uh, maybe it could be. It could be a big hit. It opens theaters nationwide on December 20th. So now it's time to let you in on another little secret, folks. Um, Paul McCartney, or should we say, and we should say, Sir Paul McCartney, because when you get the title, give him an applause. Because when you get that title. I think you should use it when you're waiting in line at restaurants. I mean, just in general. Hi, I'm Sir Paul McCartney. Uh, he's been writing a new musical. It's it's about an old story. He's been writing songs for the stage musical adaptation of the 1946 classic oh. film, It's a Wonderful Life. Oh. Remember, it was a young Jimmy Stewart in that movie. I know, because I cast him in 1946. <laughs> and according to the reporting in the New York Post, McCartney has now written more than 10 songs, with one source saying the demos, quote, sound like a bona fide Lost Beatles album. Ooh, wow. mm. I like so it. the plan is to debut a production in England late 2020 and then a movie and then on to Broadway. So that's what it looks like at this point right there. So congratulations. Yeah, I'm excited about that too. Audience, it's time to work a little bit because if you're really ready for the last pop news, can I get a laptop drum roll? Yeah. Right, right, yeah, just hard, good, hard, and fast. Okay, that's enough, no bruises. Finally, the internet has a new star, and her name is Scooter Girl. Check it out. A group of groomsmen were taking a wedding photo outside a venue in Omaha, Nebraska, as you do. <laughs> when this happened, a mystery woman came zipping through on her uh, on electric scooter. Now, she stole the whole show with an epic photo bomb. A few weeks later, the photographer took to Facebook and tried to find her. Said, hey, friends, what's going on? They called her Scooter Girl, and the post went viral. It took an hour to find her. Her identity is revealed. Her name is Kenyatta Jefferson. She is living life now as Scooter Girl on her way to viral fame and on her way into our heights. Guys, what would you do if in your big moment, you know, the big moment of your life, you get photobombed by Scooter Girl? Take it as a sign. A oh. sign of, of a good sign or a bad sign? I don't know, but something's trying to distract me from my wedding, apparently. Uh -oh. <laughs> I mean, just... Right, TJ. I, pop news is important. Yes. Yeah. I wouldn't want to be photobombed here. Kenyatta, come on, bring it out. It's the sunglasses, it's the color, it's the scooter, it's everything. So, Kenyatta, I mean, I've never, I actually have never done this. I'm scooter curious, by the way, oh. is the way I like to, okay. the way I like to put it. What's it like to blow up and get internet fame in a very short period of time? Because it, it's just happened. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's overwhelming. It's, it's not real still. I just, when people call me scooter girl, it's just, 
I don't know, I'm just, it's just, it's just so unreal. Um, I just can't believe it. It's like a picture like that, like, will go viral. Well, like, we're going to take a picture together. Okay. You're viral. I just need a little okay, help. Okay. Guys, that was pop news. Yeah. I'm, I'm out. I'm out. Can y'all show me how to do this now? Because honestly, this is going to go bad. Amy, just take this away. Don't leave it. No, I'm, I'm going to try this way. Okay, all right. Be careful. <laughs> She's going in front of the camera. There she goes. <laughs> Thank you, Scooter Girl. Thank you, Sam.